All right, we are back. I've rested my throat for a little while. Gummo. Frickin' Marx Brothers Moogle. Hey, ass wipes, out of the way. Better be a nose wipe! Come on, move it! Oh, my God. Hey, Grandma. What's good, huh? Which way you at? Kids these days. I know that's not the voice I used. Okay, let's board the airship. We here will ask the people inside if we can hitch a ride. I mean, you know, I got ways. I, I shall go ask them. Oh, really? How come? It is not for your benefit. I am only doing this for the princess. Steiner, he was so adamant about going back to the castle before. An airship full of barrels like the ones I saw at the castle. Steiner was against going. <sighs> is this ship really headed for Lindblom? No, it will probably take us straight to Alexandria Castle. But why? Didn't you just say we should get on the ship? Yeah, I know, trust me. Hey, is it, Vivi? Those dolls they were making underground. Do you really think, do you think they look like me? Not really, They're just dolls, Vivi. It's moving. What the heck is Steiner up to? All right, we have to get on, Dagger. On a ship that's not going to Lindblom? I don't have time to explain. <laughs> I do have time to stand and pose all cockily. This way! Maybe. Oh, hey, you're going up the ladder pretty quick. Hurry up! You have nothing to worry about. Hurry before she takes off. But I'll take you to Lindblom, I promise. Push, push, push. Fine, I'll get on. It's taking off! It's not moving at all, but... Oh, soft. Ah! It's like that part in Digimon Frontier where JP's trying to be all gentlemanly and have Zoe go up a ladder before him and she's she gets all mad. I'm wearing a skirt! And he's like, uh, crap, uh, crap! And she smacks him. Ah, it's not like I did it on purpose. Please, enough! And there's that royal tone in your voice again. You okay, Vivi? Feels like I'm gonna get sucked into the sky. Let's go inside, baby. You know, we had any turbulence, Monkey Boy's gonna be falling right off. I trust you. I'm still gonna close the door. I get the feeling she doesn't quite trust me yet. You should wouldn't kiss her to if I try hard enough. <laughs> well, already. Um, what is it? Something wrong? It's Vivi. Vivi? Um, wow. They're alive. And they're moving around. Um, so the mages built in the village bring back the new ones? Oh, Vivi. Vivi? Vivi? Um. Hmm. Were you able to talk to any of them? No. It's like. They don't even see me at all. I tried. Again and again. But. They won't even turn around. Maybe. I need to go upstairs for a little bit. I gotta turn the ship around before it reaches the castle. Hmm, 
keep an eye on Phoebe, okay? Alrighty. What's behind all of this? What? Old engine? Limbloom is the only place that sells mist engines. Must be using the same engine they bought years ago. Oh, that's the thing. Alexandria is not technologically advanced, but the stuff we saw in the village of Dolly was, so... Um, I don't know. Hey, douchebag. Answer me. Hey, ass face. Up there on the balcony. Answer me. Gonna come up with the disparaging nicknames for all of you. Hey! How could this happen? What am I to do? I never expected things to go so badly. I cannot believe the ship just took off without the princess. What will I say to Queen Braun? What the heck were you doing? You almost took off without us. That is because this ship's crew. It... <gasps> Why, you. Where is the princess? In the engine room. She's on the ship? Yeah. Oh, it's well now. This ship is returning to the castle. It will be hanged for kidnapping the member of a ro. Blah. It will be hanged for the kidnapping of a member of the royal family. Enjoy your freedom while you can. I will not let you near the princess. I shall come up with disparaging nicknames for you all the way there. He doesn't even see me. Will not make a Cena joke. Will not make a Cena joke. Come on! Butt face, come on! Braid for braids, come on! At last, Queen Braun is sure to be pleased. Hmm, however, the princess would have been left behind without the thief's aid. I shall petition for a life sentence on his behalf. Yes, that would be the honorable thing. But that was because the crew wouldn't listen. I must run a background check on them. Ah, yes, it is my duty as a knight. What, what? The He's to Final Fantasy what Looker is to Pokemon. Come on. <laughs> Try to do a little static -y noise there. Turn it in entirely to one side! What's wrong? Is that stuck in your throat? <laughs> you insolent fool! Turn the ship around! <laughs> See, this is what I mean. He has a prehensile tail. I will have your head for that! Hey, I think we upset them. They didn't respond to anything until now. You're the one who started this trouble. I apologize. Please wait while I take this fool into custody and turn the ship around. What's wrong? Hmm. Oh, Phoebe! Are you okay? So number two was defeated by a small child. You are no match against my power. <laughs> Princess, stay there while I eliminate this child. Are you protecting him? Nonsense. You are no different from mindless dolls. What can you do? Get out of my way. Do you dare to fight a black waltz? Black Waltz is styling in that coat.
<laughs> Mr. Vivi, I shall assist you! Hey, you guys! Hacker. Yes? We'll take care of the Black Waltz. You steer the ship. Things are gonna get even more dangerous from here on. It's not too late to turn back. You can go back to the castle or cross Southgate and Lindloom. It's your choice. I'll be with you either way, but try not to crash the ship. I... It's okay. Careful, I'll be fine. Why? Why would you do such a thing? Weren't they your friends? You fool. Do I look like some lowly black mage soldier? Even if they were your allies, what you did was reprehensible! <laughs> Worry not about them. Many more are being produced even now. What are you? Ah, the princess's bodyguards have gathered. How very convenient. Answer me. is getting all antsy. <laughs> That's right. Mm. Hey, big parrot. do anything. Oh, heh. Curses, he's too far up in the air to hit up, isn't he? Rusty, come on, we gotta get you some different armor. It looks like a lightning rod in that thing. Do, 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 do. 
Yeah, here we go. Dang. There we go. I feel like I need to get right up close to the microphone to do this voice. I exist only to kill. I went BRB mode for a second because I touched the screen and I don't know why. Just how many black waltzes do we have to fight? This is becoming ridiculous. I think that was the last one. How do you know? Are you... You said waltz, right? Don't you think number three would be the last one? I'm gonna go for it. Hey Rusty, hold on to Sutton. Oh, there's that hat just stuck on there, even though by all logic it shouldn't be. That I did see. Did you see that? Our black mage enhancements. Our enhanced black mages! All defeated. Betrayed us, Steiner did. It is all his fault. Huh? Unstable the ship becomes. Don't let go of the steering wheel. Number three is coming back. True is it? Hooray! Something is wrong. It's broken. Made its magic too powerful, we did. There's nothing we can do now. Depart, shall we? We shall depart! Run away! I exist only to kill, I exist only to kill, I exist only to kill, I exist only to kill. Do you see Southgate? Yes. Southgate is a huge gate built exclusively for airships, but maneuvering through it can be tricky. Want me to do it, Dagger? I want to do it on my own. Alright, this isn't the sort of thing to exert your independence over, though. We don't have clearance, they might close the gate on us. Should be okay though. Security was totally lax when I came through here on the station. You would not believe what we had. Just, 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 it'll be fine, Captain Dagger. Roger. But come on, just behind Blank's eye patch alone. I think we were packing a good six. That. Ah, hmm. Yes, I am still in front of royalty. It's old, but the engine's got power. Yeah, that's all I was talking about. Hmm. Princess. Please turn the ship around. The Black Waltz is heading straight towards us on an airship. He might crash into us. Dagger. Rusty's right. It's headed straight for us. Punch it. Go through the south gate. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. What if the gate closes on us? There's no way we can outmaneuver him in this cargo ship. <laughs> we'll slide in before the gate closes and shut him out. That's our only chance. Rusty! Turn the power up to max of that lever over there! <laughs> Dagger! Stay on course no matter what! Okay! I know we can make it! Shit, we need to grab Vivi. Like, seriously, we need to grab Vivi and get him in here! Maybe tie him to something! Yeah, there we go! Oh, okay, it's on a spike. That's how it's staying up. We need to tie a rope around you, Vivi. Get along well with uh, the Donny, Zodane, Shadon, whatever you say his name is. He'd get along well with Pretz from Legend of the Crystals. Hey, sucker, do you exist to use a fire extinguisher?
Hey, we got any hailing frequencies? Hey! Oh, I know Blizzard. Not that kind of hail, baby. I think we pushed a little too hard. That's so silent, people. We made it! Come on! Cheer up! South Gate was badly damaged. It was my fault, wasn't it? Don't worry about it! They'll fix it up in no time! You idiot! The cargo ship was wrecked, we lost all the cargo, and South Gate was destroyed! I can't believe I played a part in this debacle! Steiner. Yes, Princess. I didn't mean to get you involved, but you saved us. I thank you. Such kind words. I am not worthy. I'm kneeling in broken glass and my armor only goes down to my knees. <laughs> well, now I've made up my mind. I vow to protect you, princess, until we return to the castle. Uh, how do you feel about that dagger? He'll follow you to the end of the world. You know, the, the figurative, location-wise. I mean, I hope it doesn't come to literal, because that would suck. It's okay. Hey, I can see the main gate of Lindblom. That's Lindblom Castle? How gigantic. The city of Lindblom is inside the castle. <sighs> I guess Dagger and I will go our separate ways once we reach Lindblom. I see. And so we're beginning to get close. Hey. Those black mages and I. Are we the same? I don't understand, Master Vivi. Just what seems to be the problem? I don't know. Master Vivi, why would those mages be the same as you? And why would it matter if they were? Rusty's right. Uh, you're an individual, no matter what happens, Vivi. Right. Let's go out to the deck, Vivi. You gotta see Lindblom from above. It's the best. Look, the Falcon's Gate is right in front of us. I am plugging this in while we watch the screenshot. This new computer has a lot longer battery life, but, you know, still runs out. Those graphics. Ah, uh, crisp. Tell me if the color got darker for you guys, because it got darker for me. Wow, this castle is huge. It's even bigger than Alexandria Castle. Yeah, they don't call it Lindblom Grand Castle for nothing. Indoor airship dock, this is truly amazing. Even Her Majesty's Red Rose would easily fit in here. Dagger, you don't look too impressed. Have you been here before? Yes, I came here a few times when I was little. I haven't been here since my father passed away. Here comes the welcoming committee. That's a really little airship. Greetings. I am Princess Garnetil Alexandros. I humbly request an audience with Regent Sid. You must be kidding. 
No member of the royal family, let alone a princess, would ever ride in such a shabby airship. And look at the company you're keeping. How dare you accuse the princess of lying! The princess was forced to come here under extreme circumstances! Now show me some kind of proof of your royal heritage. Yeah, I'm in a blood test or something. Very well. It's a pendant. Is it a falcon claw? No, the shape is a little different. Uh, call Minister Artania. If you weren't such a filthy looking oaf, they would not be suspicious of us. Hey, I'm not the idiot with the loud voice and the dirty, rusty armor. Well, I mean, my voice is kind of loud, but still. What? What is going on? Sir, we have unknown visitors who wish to see the regent. And one of them is carrying a pendant that looks like a falcon claw. <gasps> you are dismissed. I'll take care of this. Yes, sir. <laughs> Uncle Artanya! It's good to see you, princess. Please follow me. The regent is waiting. What's he a regent for? A regent is like a placeholder for a, for a new monarch. Hey, Morid. I'm taking the day off. You look a bit tense. Why don't you relax a bit and listen to my story? Come on, you'll love it. This is your other chance to hear it. Okay, here it goes. When I was 27... Yeah. <sighs> Do I have to look at this fountain for something? The metal. Lindblom Bloom Castle is three levels, all connected by this lift. From the base level, which lies below the mist, you can take a trolley to the harbor and back gate. Hmm. <sighs> Ships hardly arrive at the harbor anymore since travel by air has become so popular. Mist poses great danger, so we've sealed off everything. Just above the base level is the mid level. You can ride the air cab from the mid level to go to town. The upper level contains the royal chamber and conference room. Access to that level is restricted because the regent himself lives there. Hey, Dagger, what's Regent Sid like? I lived in Lindblom for a while, but I'd never met him. Or, no, never mind. I don't know why I said it in her voice. I lived in Lindblom for a while, but I never met him. Regent Sid is very wise. He always thinks ahead. He may seem a bit odd at times, but he is very dependable. He and my father were best friends. <sighs> wonder if he will even listen to what I have to say. Don't worry, we're not leaving until he does. We will arrive at the upper level shortly. Ah, there we go. Sire, Princess Garnet of Alexandria wishes to see you. Princess, something wrong? The region isn't here, and I don't know who... Take a look at the throne. What's wrong? Why aren't you talking? Oh, it's a Wow, even the Uglops are big and limpy. What is the meaning of this? How dare you greet the princess like this? Get that repulsive bug off the throat immediately and call the regent. Please settle down. You are before the regent. 
What? Enough of your nonsense. Steiner, stand down. I don't remember that mustache. Is it really you, Uncle Sid? Yes. Greetings is all. I am Sid Babble, Regent of Limbloom. I know it was you. I recognize your pendant's description so much like my falcon claw. I'm delighted to see you again, Garnet. You truly become a fine lady. I, on the other hand, allow me to explain. About six months ago, someone snuck into the castle and attacked the regent in his sleep. Unfortunately, we were too late. The regent had been transformed into an oglop, and his wife, Lady Hilda, was abducted. My goodness. Wouldn't they have heard about that? At least that she was abducted. Whoever pulled this off had to be highly skilled. Like me. I'll bet it was you. That's not possible. How can you be so sure? Do you know who we are? Of course. I may be a bug, but I'm still the real or a little bloom. Uncle Sid, I appreciate you seeing me on such short notice. I desperately need to speak to you about my mother. That's what I figured. But I'm sure it can wait till tomorrow. Why don't you all get some rest for today? Thank you. It is time for lunch. Please follow me. I can't stand the food at the castle. It's way too high class for my taste. Ah, I can't even get full on this stuff. Ah, cheap food here is a lot better. Today's special is soup to silence. Not bad. Yeah. Yo, Pops! I love the stupid special! Who said that? Hey, ass face, I figure it was you. How you been? Wow, that serving girl. <laughs> Check her out. Alright, I guess. Have a seat, you're super ready in a minute. Do you mind? You're standing in everyone's way. Wow. Damn, baby. Back that thing up. Yeah, do you want a drink? How about you and me go for a cruise on an airship? Really? An airship? Sounds like you've never been on one. You know, Lindblom is quite a sight from high above. Hey, monkey tail, you're disturbing the other customers. What the? You got a tail too, rat face! Rat face. After I finish my drink, I'm gonna kick your butt. I don't know. I feel like she should have an accent. Hmm. Hey, dork. Take it outside. Ugh. What kind of accent should she have? I I'm doing everyone southern. Hmm. Maybe... Some kind of, some variety of British. The problem is I'm not too consistent with my British accent. And I'll just keep doing like I have been. Tell, tell me what you want her to sound like. Long time butt lunch. Hey, what's up? Wait a minute. You forgot my name. No, I remember. Uh, you're Helga, right? Wrong. Christine, then you could just name her Helga. Christine? No. Oh, yeah! You used to live next door to me. How's it going, Rachel? Man, you've really gotten big. Nasty little. Uh, come on! I'm just kidding. You know, I never forget a pretty girl's name. Or yours. Diamond and hand left. I was wondering if there were going to be any exceptions. Like, uh, anything other than right-handed. That's a, such an odd picture to show of her. I know that is her character picture, but... Still. So, how you been, Freya? I don't know. 
I'm, I, I'm still not happy with the voice I'm doing, so... Same old done. How long has it been? About three years. Hey, did you ever find out anything about your boyfriend? No. So, that brings you to Lindblom. Festival of Art. What else? It's a good opportunity to test my skills. Oh, well, I'm sure you'll find him someday. Why don't you participate in... Nah, I will pass. Lazy bum. Are you ever going to go back? I had no reason to return to Benicia. There's nothing there for me anymore. It's kind of Australian, but that kind of works for her. So, how is the queen? Is she still as vibrant as ever? Yes, but... Since father died, mother has been acting very strangely. I'm not surprised. We loved each other so much. We haven't spoken much lately. Also, a suspicious man has been prowling around the castle. I don't know what's going on anymore. I fear that she might be planning something terrible. I brought this matter to everybody's attention, but no one has taken me seriously. They all think I'm distraught over losing father. I understand why you're so eager. I'm happy that you came to me for help. At this point, I think you're the only person Mother will listen to. When I heard that Lim Lim's leadership was coming to Alexandria, I decided to sneak on board and come here no matter what. I just never expected the crew to kidnap me. It was me. I was the one who ordered Tantalus to kidnap you. Uh huh. I once promised your father that should anything happen, I would protect you. We well, known about the disturbances of Alexandria for some time. But had we acted directly, it would have started a war. So I asked Bacco for help. He and I go way back. The play was the perfect cover to enter Alexandria and get you out. No one would suspect Lynn Bloom was behind it. You know, he could have just sent an invitation for Garnet to come stay with him and then just explained to her the situation and kept her there. We are forced to take action because we knew what Alexandria would never seek our help. I'm relieved the way we're able to get you here. At the village of Dolly, we saw numerous black mages. They look like golems controlled by some powerful magic. On top of that, they were being created under Alexandria's supervision. I don't know how they're related to Vivi, but if Mother is planning to use them for war... We won't let that happen. Even if she were to command an army of black majors, she won't make a move as long as we have our airships. Don't worry, everything will be fine. I'm so sorry, Uncle. Now, now, come on, don't be so formal. I mean, I can't be formal. I'm helping you because I'm your uncle's sis, not because I'm the region of Lindblom. Thank you so much. <coughs> what is this place? The heart and soul of Lindblom, our airship dock. This is dot number one where we conduct our research. But where are the airships? Lonely, isn't it? We had a new airship model in here about six months ago. Well, with our latest creation, mod would didn't require mist to fly. The man who attacked you, was he the one who ran off with it? I never thought it was a man. Good guess, but no, actually. No, I met a lovely lady at the pub. Um, when Hulu found out about my little affair, she used her magic and turned me into an old one. Then she stormed off in the new airship, which I named Hildegard. It's pretty ironic, isn't it? I don't know why you're telling me this. This is too much information. But she hasn't been back since. I've been working on Hildegard too. 
well, but I hasn't been going too well. My mind just isn't the same as an old lot. I'm hopeless. But that doesn't mean I can't help you. No, I'll do my best for Alexandria. Thank you. Just don't ever tell that story again. The South Gate badly damaged. I don't know how we can get to Alexandria. No, I mean, South Gate is being repaired as we speak. Once the repairs are finished, we'll go to Alexandria. Yes, I'm sure Mother will finally open her eyes to the truth. Mm. Uncle? Is something wrong? And if it's another story like that last one, all you have to do is say yes and leave it at that. Nah, no, I was just thinking about how the theater ship crashed. Baku's sort of go men working under him. But, but, but. <sighs> Good morning. Eh, hey, Vives, you're up early. Lindbloom is really a busy place. I've never seen this many people before. I wonder where people go if they want to be alone. Well, there's a Moogle in the next room. Just standing by its lonesome. Moogle has always been like this. People come here from all over the world. Someone come here to become airship engineers, sculptors, actors. Wow. I don't remember why I came here my first time. Where I knew it, I was living here with my Tantalus brothers. It was awesome. Even though we had one bathroom. Do they still live here? Yeah, our hideouts in the theater district. It's not so much a hideout as it's more of a den, but still. I'm gonna go there right now. You wanna come along? Mm, that's okay. I'm gonna go look around town. Okay. I'll give you a little tour. No, that's okay. I can go by myself. Oh, okay. Go find yourself a cute girl, alright? Okay. Hippo. Hey, bro, what are you going to teach me today? Lots of neat stuff. Today, I'm going to talk about the synthesis shop. Blah, blah. I'll just get this stuff out of the way. I'll cut to them and press B. I need to get some more freaking cards. <laughs> yeah, give it a try and see for yourself. D do da 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 di da 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 di da da Gosh, bro, you sure know a lot. Yeah, I know. Uh. Hey, Moogle. Hey, sweet. Ain't y'all coming back to Alexandria? I'm so lonely. Just kidding. I'm opening a little theater in an alley here. Bartender mine is quitting the saloon and getting into showbiz. He asked me to help. A friend is starting a mini theater? Sounds like fun, Kubo. Let's save, Kubo. Alright, well, this one has been a heck of an episode, so I'm going to close it right here. And thank you for joining us.